Hello, everybody. Welcome back. My green screen's still messed up a little bit. I gotta figure that out. A little bit too much of like, especially with my my uh, chair going on there. I don't know. I gotta tweak that at some point. Anyway, hey, we're back here on the Volcano Block world. And uh, I think today we're gonna try to do something a little bit different. So I did move in between the last time and this. I moved the uh, colossal chest up here because it was in the way of trees and things. And I can access this up here. Now, I have been watching some of the other... Uh, YouTubers out there, and I saw that uh, Chosen Architect was using this colossal chest, but they used a, a, a thing from ours to basically be able to search it, and I thought that's amazing, and that's something I want to do. So we're gonna get into ours th today and try to figure that out. Um, so I don't know. I, we're just gonna just try it, you know, and see what happens. So let's try that out. Because I know that if this is the R's uh, tab and we go through this whole menu. And I know we got through uh, on what I saw to the enchanting apparatus. So we're just going to kind of go down this line, see what we can do here. I'm hoping that we can get whatever this was that he did and try to figure it out together. So let's just start this out. R's Nouveau is a magic mod. Yes. And we get the worn notebook. Thank you. And pop that out. Better be careful. That could just pop that out like into the lava. That would have been very, very bad. <laughs> So, uh, let's get our first spell book here. Um, it looks like it's just a bunch of iron tools and a book. Now, we might have to go get books. I don't know. I don't know how much iron we have either. So, we're just going to go through this and see what's going on. Hi, Thomas. Hi, Ram. Hi, is it is it Rager? Svensson? What's up? Welcome. And there's Thule. And Thule is there. as a member for 33 months. And, of course, I get I get a phone call. So I, I gotta say message. Sorry, I can't talk now. Uh, and I'm gonna tell the guy, Ram Hog, I'm live on my YouTube channel. Tinker77, so can't talk. Okay, uh, we're looking for iron. Oh, that chicken grew up. Uh, I need one of my nets. Okay, so see, this is where the problem is that we've got here. Oh, okay. So up here, if you look, there is a big gold chest. And trying to find stuff in here is kind of crazy. It's somewhere in here as a net. We don't know where. Did you guys see the net? Because I didn't see it. Hmm. I vain mined the bottom of my boat earlier. You'd get a nice reward for dying the first time. I don't see the net at all. Do you guys see the net? Did I put the net in like some sort of other chest or something? I might have. Got obsidian, okay. No, 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 got some eggs. No, 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 there's some iron. We gotta cook that down anyway. Okay, so. Whoa, that's not supposed to be there. So where is my uh, nets, guys? Okay, now I'm a little bit upset. I knew I had my nets on me. So I mean, I mean, I hate to think that I'm losing stuff. Cause I had, I know I had three nets. Okay, let's just put in here, net. There's a net, okay. I can't remember why I needed a net now. Oh, I was gonna get the chicken moved. Haha! <laughs> there we go. Down we go. I'm just uh, right now gonna be producing eggs so we can breed up some things and have eggs. So. Okay. Uh, let's put this back. We need to get a lot more iron because we're gonna be making the. Um, these don't have any iron in them, do they? Right, we only have four iron. We're gonna make up all the tools so we can make the book, right? That's the first thing. We gotta make a book too. I don't know if I have enough for a book. Book takes paper and leather. So we're gonna have to see. I just, this is gonna take a little while, guys. Okay. So uh, let's get. Let's get some gravel. Okay, let's put all that into there. Get some compressed. And now that my thing's up there, now it's a pain. Uh. So, we'll get this going. We'll have some fun here. 
I thought I'd get a little chance to play this morning since I haven't a lot, had a lot of time to play this week. Now, I want to tell you, I'm very sad right now. I'm so sad. Because, um, this was the weekend that I was supposed to go to Dallas. Um, and in Dallas, Texas was the... This whole week coming up, starting tomorrow, was the big, big, big national train convention and train show on the next weekend. Um, and I was scheduled to go with, to that with Sally, um, and I am not going. So I'm very sad about that because I have a lot of friends in that community, and that was the big, big event for me. A week-long thing in Texas, hanging out, you know what I mean? And uh, I didn't get to do it, so... Yeah, not happy. Um, and why can't I do it? Well, that's because I had to uh, save money. Um, I don't know where I'm going to be financially, so um, I need you two to work for me some more here. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Anyway. Okay, so let's get rid of all this stuff, make some gravel, and we're going to get some resources here. Uh, very sorry to hear you're not going to the train event. Yeah, it was supposed to be a lot of fun. Um, they were staying at the Gaylord Hotel, which is a massive hotel. It looked like it was a lot of fun. Um, but I can't go, obviously, and so, uh, whatever. I mean, I did save money from it. I mean, just the hotel alone was probably going to be probably $2,000 just for the, the hotel stay for a week long at a big, big hotel. So, I get it. Um... But still, it's like, I don't know. I wanted to go. Yeah, the whole financial thing is kind of bugging me because um, there's, a, I mean, I losing a lot of income from, you know, because we're separating, I'm losing all of that income for the household. And so, I mean, it's her money. I'm not saying that's not, it's my money or anything like that. But I mean, as far as the household, we've incurred a lot of bills and those bills are staying with me, but the income's not. <laughs> so it's going to be kind of hard. And so I'm having to just make sure I'm very conservative on everything. And like I said, hopefully this will start to uh, pan out more now that I'm kind of like back doing stuff. Okay, let's go and put some of this here. I can put these pieces right away. And this will start to compress that down. See, with this compressor here, it's starting to put them in there. That's good. Now, it's not very fast, but it'll work. Let's get everything off the ground here. There we go. Give me that. Thomas says, finger crossed your financial situation gets sorted soon. Well, um, my plan for the my finances right now is, um, See, we did a lot of things. If you if you recall, I've talked about it over the last year or so. We've you know we put a new roof on the house. We've refinished the entire basement, so we can put a layout down there. So there's a lot of things going on. We've done uh, some other changes. We've had you know carpeting installed. The bathroom was kind of sort of remodeled a little bit, a little bit because it needed to be. So just some things like that. So I'm hopeful that um, with my new plan, which is to kind of go in a way that's like the Dave Ramsey debt thing, right? Put this up here. There we go. So a lot of these things here, uh, let me go into this here. Doing, sorry, I'm all over the place. I apologize. Basically trying to uh, get debt free as fast as I can to get out of the hole uh, that I'm currently in. So that's kind of like going to be this year. So if, if YouTube picks up, then yeah, that'd be awesome. That in there, and then there, and this in here. Here we go. So we're trying to get iron here. We've got ten iron. Now see, this thing is compacting pretty nicely. It's not very quick. Um, and I know you we would have gotten some if we had done the quest correctly, doing the quest down here, and you get through down to uh, this. Is it this one? No, one of these you get. You get upgrades. Let's see. A gold upgrade. I wonder if we can make that upgrade. Just make it ourselves. Um, gold and cactus and that stuff. We got cactus. We don't have cyan terracotta yet. 
Donut is here. Hey, Donut. I haven't seen you in forever. Glad you're still around. Didn't know if you were paying attention to us anymore. <laughs> Glad you're here. Okay, so don't see any more iron. I mean, it's got iron, but let's move these around. That way it works on iron first. <laughs> you know what I mean? Let's get me the iron. I want the iron, yeah. So we're trying to make this book. So for the book here, we gotta make, we gotta have a shovel pick, basically the basic tools, right? So there's the shovel. Need more sticks. Axe. And what is it to pick, right? Okay. So those are the basic tools. I need to put that someplace else so that I don't mess with it. I'm gonna put it in here. Okay, so now we have to figure out how to get a book. A book is paper and leather, or I think, didn't we see some books someplace? I think it was in the submarine. Do I have my boat here? No, it's probably up in my chest up there. So we'll go to the submarine and we'll take out those. Unless, like, did I take out the books already over here? Maybe I did. Either way. I'll go get some books. Where's our sub? There it is. All right, here we go. Sub that I broke into. I see, I see, oh, there's, I should bring more nets because, I mean, it's a sand chicken. See, I'm hearing other, other chickens here. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, good. Excellent. Okay. That's what I wanted to see. That's good. Oops. No, we don't do that. Let's go in here. I think there are books in here, right? Yes, bookshelves. Yeah, so. We got some books. Excellent. Okay. So let's go back out of here. We're gonna keep, we're gonna go and get these chickens. Um because we, we definitely need the chickens. So let me go get some more nets. Actually, I'm gonna do the set home trick. This is something I learned last night, okay? Or last night, the other time we were here. So I'm gonna go down here where the chickens are. And undo a set home. This is now my home. And then you can do there's a, the command is skyblock home will take you to your actual home. There it is. Which is down here. So you spawn in normally when you first started. Zoe plays us here, says, hey, hello, welcome to the stream. Glad you're here. It's a sand chicken. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have a lot of problems here. <laughs> let's go get the stuff here. Let's go put this away first. Actually, I'm gonna need that in a second. Let's not put that away. And let's look for nets again. Because we have three nets, I think. There is another wart, which is kind of like a net. Okay, so where are my other nets? He says I only have one net. I had more nets than that. I had like three. I guess I got to make more nets. Okay, whatever. Uh, so if the net, how do you make the net? It's string and sticks. Okay, so let's look for string in here. Okay, I don't know how we're gonna get it, so let's just grow up some trees. Um, I'm, I'm not sure why stuff is missing. There's some string. Never mind. Okay. I should make a crafting table and put it up here, but that's a, we'll do that too in a little bit. Let's get some nets. Let's uh, get some sticks. Net. There. Got a bunch of nets. Now let's go home and bloop. We're here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Is 
like that, we got all the stuff. Now I can do that same uh, command to go back. And there we are. So I'm going to put the regular chickens. It says chicken. Okay, it's chicken right here. Regular one. I'm going to put this regular one right here. That's not a regular one. There we go. Awesome. And I'm going to hold on to the rest of this. I'm going to make, I think I've got a chest up there in, in my other big chest. I'm going to put these nets in there for now after I figure out where the cactus ones go. Donut says, it's been so long. Yes, yeah, been busy with life stuff, so my apologies. So, well, that's okay. You're allowed. Okay, so we have, this is an empty net. Empty net. All the empties can go up there. See, this is chicken. I don't want that. This is sand. This is cactus. This is cactus. This is chicken. This is cactus. This is a sand chicken. Boop. And then the cactus chicken. Boop. 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 I think that'll work. See, so already we got some basic chickens. Excellent. Okay. I haven't tried to convert a chicken. Not sure how it works. I don't know how you mean by convert a chicken. Um, you just breed chickens. It's like just like breeding any other animal. So. Okay. Back to what we're trying to do here. We've got books now. So let's go get our big spell book here. The Ars Nouveau spell book. We need to get the other tools that are down in my inventory. And we'll have this done and then we're kind of work. Now again, for people who just showed up, what I'm trying to do is I did see that when Chosen Architect played with the big Colossal Chest just recently in Volcan Volcano Block, he used an Ars thing to actually manage that inventory. And so I want to do that. I think that was really a good idea. So we'll see what we can do here. So let's put this right here. We don't want that pick. Let's want the good pick. There we go. Got our book. Yay. Okay, so. We got a potion of mana regen and more experience. That's good. How have you been doing recently? Well, um, you probably didn't know Sally Green Gamer and I are separating. So that's basically what's going on. Eh, it is what it is. Not happy about it, but it wasn't my choice. Um, I'm going to take a drink here. Okay, we gotta get archwood logs. Any of them. So, to get these, how do you get the logs? You gotta get probably a sapling. Archwood. So, like to get a blue sapling, you need to get from sieving leaves. Okay, so we gotta get some leaves. That tells me a lot. Um, get some space here. So we'll get some saplings, I guess. Vanilla chickens can be converted by giving them 250 of an item according to the quest. That, um, yeah, you can do that. I didn't know that's what you meant. But, I mean, I don't... It only does work for certain ones. I mean, I... I rather like breeding them, so... Okay, let's get rid of a lot of this stuff here. Let's put this away. I don't know I had another sword. Okay. Keep that on me. I need iron all the time. Um, saplings. I have an axe, don't I? You have an iron axe someplace. Yes, I do. Okay. I guess it doesn't matter if we're going to be vein mining, but uh, shears. Shears for the leaves. Uh, can we make flint shears? Flint. You can make flint shears. Oh, good. That, get, that makes that real easy. I mean, I've got a ton of flint. <laughs> okay. There we go. Ton of flint. Do four of those for now. Twerk. Now we can get bigger trees, thankfully. Can't wait to get past this point. Um, we're trying to get enough for the... Um, I'm going to get a lot of leaves because this is also how we get dirt. So... Wow. That didn't really work well. Oh, because it's broken. They're broken. I wish they would get rid of broken stuff instead of like leaving it there. I just... I don't like that. Are 
running low on saplings. We probably are. I probably need to like just do a regular harvest for this one. The one that says, I used to enjoy modded Minecraft a lot. I enjoy it every time. It's so much fun. Let's get some more saplings just in case. But I don't understand it anymore because I don't play much of it. Yeah, well, you got to get back into it. What's, what's the dealio there? Thomas is back. Welcome back, Thomas. Can I get some more leaves? We're trying to get some leaves so that we can get uh, some other things here. Okay, that one's broken. Oh my gosh, way up there. I hate that I messed this, up this whole scaffolding and I don't know how to get it back also so all right now i'm gonna be asking for help eventually on how to make this thing that we're gonna do for ours so uh, those are broken so when we get to that point i may be asking for help for research but okay uh donut says i got into hypixel or, or skyblock around three years ago and i'm really enjoying it is that fun i mean is that really fun i just I don't like dealing with people like that. I get, I really, you know, I used to play uh, like games like uh, Starcraft and stuff like that. And, you know, but so many people play it and they're so competitive. I just, I can't do it. I just, I just can't. Okay. So we're trying to get in here and trying to get some of the archwood logs, right? Or saplings. Okay. So there we go. We got each type. I like purple. So we're going to do purple. Should be able to just go through this since we got it and not put more in okay right okay so then you just do that and you should be able to get archwood logs right if it grows here if it doesn't grow we'll go we'll have to do some dirt up top meanwhile let's put all the rest of these leaves in here there we go let's get rid of this maybe this is in the way Okay, so that's not growing. Uh, let's get a piece of dirt. And let's go up here and just do it up top. I'm trying to get archwood logs. Fool says, I hate griefers. Totally ruin multiplayer games. Yes, I would agree. Um, it's too hard to see. So I have this whole plot over here that will not work. Um, I might have to try to get some delightful dirt. But for now... There we go. That worked out great. And let's see if I can get this all done. And nice. Okay, we got our Archwood Logs quest done. Right? And now we gotta make it into planks. So let's do that. Um, there we go. Planks got us the quest. Okay. So, we need to uh, do the imbument chamber to create one of the main crafting items in ours, a source gem. You'll need to make an imbument chamber. So, let's bookmark this. And this is just logs and gold, and we've got that. So, let's go do that right now. See, like I said, the goal is to get this chest to work for us instead of against us. All right. Uh... So this should be about done processing all that stuff, right? I guess not. Hmm. Sound like an SG-1 ref. Nice. Actually, speaking of SG-1, um, I started re-watching that. Don't know if I'm going to grab some lunch. And I'll join back in a little bit. Okay, see you in a little bit. Um... Yeah, so, uh, okay, so Sally Green Gamer and I would always watch shows, you know, hang out in the evening or whatever, um, but it was very slow going um, because, uh, you know, everybody would take a break or something like that. So, anyway, I'm in between lots of series and I thought, well, I want to watch something. I'm gonna, so I'm starting to rewatch the uh, the uh, Stargate SG-1 series. Actually, I'm watching all of Stargate in order. So, 
yeah, that's that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna make four of these right now. Okay, so there we go. And so now I want to see about getting lapis. And I believe all you do is you just place these down and you get stuff. So, um, yeah, I'm watching SG One. I'm gonna watch the whole show, all the shows in order that they were aired. Okay, so I'm gonna put this over here. I'm gonna put four of these down. And I think all you do is you put uh, this in here, right? And it will slowly create source gems. Okay. So we got a source gem already? Why did we get this quest here? Did we get a source gem that's in here? Let's, maybe we already have one. Yep, we did. We got four. Must have found that someplace. Okay, so we're doing really good now. So now we got to try to figure out. Um, Cause I know we got to go through, and we got. Uh, come on, stop talking to me. In fact, I got to remember to do that. Put my watch in that mode. So we're trying to get to the enchanting apparatus. So let's just work our way to here. I think that's what's the key uh, that we need to get to. I'm gonna take another drink. Um. We need source links for it? I don't know. Source stone. How do you get source stone? Looks like basically any polished stone and a gem. Okay. And look at that. We got some more gems. So if I just do that. Excellent. Okay. So uh, I have eight diorite. That's great. Can we polish that? Yep. Put one of these in here, and there we got our eight source stone. Excellent. Next thing we're gonna make is arcane pedestals. We need to make eight of these, it says. So it's gonna take just to make one. Just to make one takes four of these, right? So we need four times eight. What would be that be? Like thirty-two? Yeah. We need more of these things. Oh, I gotta eat. Uh, it'd be great if we have some other, like, block that's, like, ready to be made. That's, you know, not, I mean, we can't, we can't do a cobble, I don't think. I think it has to be, like, an actual, like, stone. God, like, I can't wait for this to be, like, normal layout, you know? I mean, can it work on cobble? I don't think it can. Do I make cobble in here? Probably do. Let's just see. I think it's got to be like a regular stone. Yeah, nope. Okay, well, down we go. Yeah, we're getting materials. This thing's still processing? It's still processing. It's so slow. But hey, you know, we're getting stuff in here, right? Which is good. Uh, got a bunch of dirt. That's good. It's still running. So we're doing okay. Wish we had time in a bottle. I really need to get this thing going faster, so. I can get rid of this and this. And let's just get... Uh... There. Okay, so we got a bunch of stone cooking up. Okay, so we're trying to make uh, that. This thing right here. And we need eight of those, right? So, and each one takes gold nuggets, source gems, and the, that stuff, right? So we're going to need nuggets for sure. There we go. And I said we need 32 of the block, right? Uh-huh. There's 24. We need, what do we need? Some, like, eight stone? We got five. We're getting there. <clears throat> Let's just get them all. There we go. Eight. 
and do this and that gives you this and there we go and i want to make i think four of these are eight of these right so there's our eight that gets us that quest okay and we get some sort of something some sort of whatever um now do we need a ritual brazier i don't know we need the enchanting apparatus for sure Arcane core and enchanting apparatus. Okay, let's do the enchanting apparatus next. Okay, so we're gonna need more of the stone. We're gonna need more of the uh, source gems probably. Let me get some more of those done. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm slowly trying to move out of the bottom down there. Uh, once we get the storage up here running, I think it'll work better. So, okay. And we need to make that. Okay, we got those source stones. Between two gold and a, a diamond. Okay. Well, now we gotta look for my diamonds. I don't know if I even have diamonds. Do I have diamonds? Do you guys have diamonds? I do have diamonds. Okay, we need a diamond. Some gold. Enchanting apparatus. Now, I have not done this in so long. Let me get rid of these things here real quick. I can put those in my chest. Put them in the big chest. Um, Thomas says, I have one diamond. Yeah, you'll get them as you get there, right? Just like I did. Let's do this again. Okay, I want to get rid of some of this stuff. Okay, um, I'm trying to remember how to use this. Then you gotta put it on top of a something. Okay, let's just, let me go look at this. Or do I have to, I have that book. I could probably look at the book, but you have to put it on top of the arcane core. Okay, so we're gonna make an arcane core. I thought I had more gold on me. Maybe not. Up and down we go. Okay, so, and I, this is something that I saw. Um, like I said, I watched Chosen Architect. He started this series recently, so. Uh, this is pretty cool. I thought he he had this uh, device here, and then he put these on the side of it. But I think you can make these smaller and use up to eight of them. So what he did was he he made it like this on the sides attached, and put this on top, and so that allows us to create things. And that's where we're going with this. And so now I got to figure out what he did. Um, he had a and some sort of rod. Let's look at ours. Like a, like a binding rod or something like that. Was it this one? A dousing rod. No, it's, I mean, it's a wand. Yeah, this is what it was. A dominion wand. Okay, so it takes a gold, two sword stones, and a stick on top. So, let's see here. We need a gold, two things, and a stick in the top part. So, if we do this and this... And that, and then put it in here. So it starts magical spinning. Very nice. Okay, that helps us. I guess it's kind of like a binding thing. So uh, we have to get a... Well, this is where I was kind of confused on it, and this is where I probably will need help. I think it was called a bookworm or a bookworm charm. Yeah. Uh, obtained by augmenting a ritual of awakening with a book of quills. Augmenting a ritual of um, awakening. What do we get here? So, where is the ritual of awakening?
Uh, Tablet of Awakening. So that's what I'm trying to figure out now. Is there, are these, these are tablets? Maybe we should get the book out. This is where I, I'm going to be confused on. Uh, Worn notebook. Okay. So we're trying to do Ritual of Awakening. Awakens nearby archwood trees into wheeled walkers and budding amethysts and golems. Augmenting with Book of Quilts will create bookworm charms. Okay, so Tablet of Awakening. A tablet used for rituals consumed to use. So we gotta make this tablet. It's like wood and some gems. Okay, so let's see. Um, looks like we need all of that wood again. The arch. There's red. I guess we gotta get each color. Wasn't there blue somewhere? There's blue. I got the archway on us. Okay. Uh, okay. So awakening. I'm trying to make this right here. Get out of this mode. Flourishing arc archwood log. What's that? I guess it's the green tree. Okay, where's my uh, <laughs> my mob spawning area without mobs? It's over here. Need a very specific tree, so I guess the green one's the one you should make. Gather all the stuff. Something just fell down. Okay. Try to make that now. And okay, so now we got this. Now, how do you augment it? <laughs> so we got that, right? That's good. And we got to get the bookworm charm obtained by augmenting a ritual of awakening with a book and quill. So we're going to have to get a book and quill. And I know. I know I have book. Book and quill, what does it take? It takes, I know I've got books. I know I've got feathers. I think I have an ink sack. So let's look around for book first. There's our book. Feather. I see the feathers right there. Is there an ink sack? I thought for sure I had an ink sack. Or maybe if I spelled it right. Yeah, I do have an ink sack. Okay. So we definitely need to make a book and quill. It could be a tree that does well in that climate. That's true. Book. Feather. Ink sack. is a book and quill. Okay, we got a book and quill. Ink. Ink with a case. <laughs> Thank you, CT. So, uh, augment. Now we gotta figure out how to do this augment. Right? How do you augment it? Glyphs, 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 source, machines, automation. That's how I don't know. How do you, do you, I wish I wish I had like a recipe for this. We're trying to make the bookworm charm. Obtained by augmenting a ritual of an awakening with book and quills. And I, I can't, I'm, I'm assuming you can't just throw it in like together, like throw this together and this together. You know, you have to do some sort of ritual. How do you do that? Hmm. Hmm. So how do you augment a charm? 
Looking for charms. Made a tablet. So do you put like a book here? Let me try something here. This may be a bad idea. Do you do this and then uh, you take the, where, where did it go? This up here. No. What if you do that? If you do it the other way. No. Okay, so that's not how you do it. Okay, so we got to read, guys. Unless someone knows off the top of their head how to do this. Uh, so this was, is it rituals? These are rituals. Awakening. Awakens nearby archwood trees and, and into wheeled walkers and budding amethyst to amethyst golems. Wheeled walkers can be given a position in the world to guard against mobs. They will heal over time and turn into wheeled waddlers if they die. To create a wheeled walker, perform this ritual near the base of an archwood tree. Augmenting with a book and quills will create bookworm charms. Maybe you can steal some cereal from a leprechaun to get a charm. Yeah, that's, that's, no. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Is there like an index? Okay. Bookworm charm. Bookworm charms can be used on a storage lectern to increase the number of accessible inventories, augment a ritual of awakening with a book and quilt in order to obtain charms. In the event that they die or dispelled, yeah, this is a bookworm charm. So it takes some chests and a lectern to make a that. Okay, that's easy. We can do that in a minute. Um, so I don't know how to augment okay how do you get a bookworm charm guys someone go look that up <laughs> uh see it looks like you got to put stuff around it in the enchanting apparatus, so maybe we need that. The rituals all can be used for decoration. Why does it like to form rituals? So maybe this is what we need here. The ritual. Let's try to build this. We can do this pretty quick, right? A source gem block, an arcane pedestal, and some gold. I mean, you know, won't hurt to try, right? Uh, okay, we got that. This is used in making this. Um, waiting activation. I need like a button. <laughs> I don't know if I did the right thing. Oh, oh, that worked. So I do what I did was I put the uh, charm on there first, or sorry, the uh, tablet on there first, and then put in the uh, the book and quill, and then I activate it. Nice. Okay, that's good. I don't want this here though. I figured that out. Okay, we're getting there. Um, so I think what I want is then now we gotta get that lectern made with some chests. So I know get to, I know that I've got a lectern down here, so I'm gonna grab that. Because honestly, I don't need it. We may be close to having inventory management for this big, big, big chest. Something I wanted to do this morning. Okay, so we need to get four chests. So let's look in here. I think I've got some chests. I can get rid of some of this stuff, too. Uh, there's some six chests. Okay, so you put the chest around here. 
There's four chests and a lectern. And I should create this thing. Come on. And we put that right there. Awesome. Now it says connected inventory is none. I think we have to use a bookworm charm on it. Let's connect the inventory though. I think it's... Okay, it says maximum number of inventories locked. Add more book charms. Can we just click this? Bookworm charm? Oh, look! We got a bookworm charm. Now, let's try this again. This to this. Inventory added. Oh my gosh, did this work right? So we got the little thing there. Yes! Look, guys. We have like an inventory and a crafting grid. So now I can just start to stick this stuff into this chest. And it's doing all the work. Thank you, little bookworm charm. Oh, that's excellent. Oh my gosh. Immediately I can see what I've got. That's excellent. Nice. Okay. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to start to move some of that stuff that we have down there up here. What a charming inventory interface, says Thomas. Ah, <laughs> I mean, isn't that cool? I mean, okay, so I can get rid of this and this and this. And it might be a little bit sluggish, but that's okay. So let's get some of that inventory that we have down there up here. The slow move out has begun. And we can make that chest bigger. Pretty easy. In fact, I, maybe I want to do that and make it a 5x5, five five, but we'll see. It's like this chest here. I don't want it here. Oh, oh awesome. Okay. Um, a lot of these mechanisms I have down here I'm just using for other things, so. Eventually, we're going to get auto sieving up top, too. Oh, excellent. Okay. <laughs> throw all this in here of course a sluggish it was just born today yes that's true but I mean it, it works like I all the stone pebble now is this let me search is there a way to non sync sync search Okay, so let's do stone, no, search here, stone, pebbles. There, look at that. And then we can go in here, our inventory, and I can just sit here and compress all this down. Boom, 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 boom. And then uh, there should be a way to clear this out easily, right? Yeah. Let's uh, get some bread. We're gonna need some, uh, Hold on, can I just do it? Let me, let me put that back. Okay. And let's do bread. Okay, so it's not sink down there, but it is up here. Okay, we've got 60 bread. Didn't need that much bread, but hey, whatever. Aha! I'm like, I'm really liking this. Okay, so that is awesome. So now let's figure out what we're going to do here. Uh, for the rest of the day. I thought that would take a lot longer, <laughs> honestly. Where's my other quest? I got a quest that I haven't picked up yet. Oh. Okay. Those in there. Awesome. Well, okay, so now we're getting back to here. There's a lot of things that I haven't done yet. I need to figure this out. Um, cause we, we, we don't have a lot of automation yet. So like for instance, uh, how do we get more materials that we want to do? We want to get more, I just get some mob spawning of course, but I would like to like, for instance, get redstone more automated. So how are we going to do that? I just had a buzz. Hmm. So right now it's mostly, well, to do it all, we're going to have to use sieving, right? Let's just, let me get down with the quest. Let's go to the quest line here. Just get through here and get to this point and 
so we get some of the uh, rewards from this. So let's get netherrack. Let's just do that. So how do you get netherrack? Is there a way to get netherrack? It's probably using lava. Yes, redstone in lava. So let's see. Do we have any redstone? We have some redstone. Okay, and we have lava down here. Going to this little setup. Um, you know what? This is pumping out lava. Let's pump that out into another. I think we have the bin down here. Did I move it up top? I think I have it up top. So I think we get if you do use use um, redstone, you can get netherrack, right? But if you put glowstone in it, maybe you get something else like endstone. So let me get some stone crucible. I think they're called. Is a stone barrel. Uh, yeah, this. Oh, look at that. It just this is so much nicer, guys. It is. Let's get some fluid pipes. There we go. You know what? While we're at it, let's get some item pipes. <laughs> and let's get a wrench. Oh, this is so much nicer. <laughs> okay. Uh so right down here we have our lava is going to here. So let's set up. Hmm. I'm going to put the two of them right here and here. I'm going to have output going into a, a an inventory, which would be a barrel or a chest. Okay, let's see if I got any more barrels. I like these barrels. Yes, I do. Did that not do what I wanted? Okay, hold on. Uh, can we, can we, I wish where's the clear button. This is a, that's the clear button. Okay. Okay. Right. So let's get this over here. We're gonna put this as our inventory and we're gonna set this side to extract here and here. Okay. And now we want to pipe from here lava and I set that to extract excellent okay and then um, let's see if we make some like hoppers like wood hoppers that'll work right let's make a couple more barrels and put that back and let's make a hopper I'm doing this one for each side Actually, why, why am I using hoppers? Why don't you use my pipes? Piping into here. I mean, barrel or hoppers are so, like, you know, vanilla. Okay, so if I put in redstone in here. Let's put a half a stack here. There it goes, netherrack. And it pops it out. Excellent. Okay, so that's gonna get us netherrack. And I believe for endstone, um, this is crushed endstone, but regular endstone, I think you get that with glowstone, right? So how do we get glowstone? We should have glowstone already, don't we? This is the way we'll eventually be able to automate this a lot better. We have a piece of glowstone. That'll get us close. Get us the quest anyway. Oops, too far. Oh no, I gotta go up further. Keep forgetting which floor things are on. There we go. Oh, gotta set this to extract. There's endstone. Why is it not extracting? That should be extracting, right? Did 
that's weird. Maybe because it's only uh, it's too close together. I don't know. Let me just grab it. <laughs> we'll figure that out. Okay, so we got everything we need here. Uh, we have to get a. Oh, let's get that back. Let's do that up top. We have to crush it to actually get the quest. I think. Um, we got the netherite one, or nether rack, I should say one, and then we got to crush the other one to get. Um, what we need here, hammer. Do I not have the hammer on me? There's the... We'll use up our stone hammer on it. Let's get crushed. Need to extract from the other side. Well, no, I mean, they're both extracting. I think it's because it's only really hooking it up to one. It should be working, but it didn't. I'm not worried about it. Okay, so now then, what is this to the end? Visit the end. We won't be finding the portal. Instead, we're going to eat cake. You need to get some gas here to make this. Which we need to have a diamond mesh for it places down. Okay, so we're not going to do that. We're not going to the end. But this allows me to get into this right here, which is getting the power generation. And we know we have that already because I built that already. Yeah, I had a conflicting junction. They're just too close. That's all good. So here's my power generation. Now we're going to get this. Uh, and it's going to bring lava into our base. So let me do this really quick. Hopefully this won't die. It died. All right. Do it the hard way. Uh, we're making the iron generator, redstone flux coil, furnace. Probably should have done this the right way. Power generation. There we go. Should have been this one, right? Why did it not give us that quest? Oh, you got transferring power first? Okay. Energy pipes. Okay. So, gotta make this right here, which we need redstone blocks. Run low on our, in, or that, but this will get us to this point. Okay, and that gets us transferring power. That also gets us the power generation, which there's also uh, RF tool starter power, and you can get mechanism with uh, some of these uh, w uh, wind uh, turbines, so that's good. So, we are close now to doing the uh, RF stuff here which is the flux hammer, the flux sieve, and the flux compactor so let's try to do that today and get a very basic setup okay okay so we want to have because we're going to be making this do automatic work for us up here. And we're going to probably eventually make another platform. In fact, maybe I should do that now. Because these platforms are together, kind of. I think I will make another platform. Let's let's just start worrying about platformage right now. My iron wand, is it, is it broken? I don't know. I got diamonds too, right? So let's do that. I want to get like storage drawers set up for these items and we're going to start to do compacting and things, right? So, uh... Diamonds are here. This is the flux block. That'll give us that portion of the quest. Let me put all this into here so we don't lose them. Okay. You should fill in blank spaces. Fill in, what do you mean by fill in blank spaces? Okay. Uh, we're slowly going to get this working. Um, I want to get gravel being made so that we can uh, have it automatically sieving that. 
So let's go ahead and make, we have this, this one part of the puzzle. We need to get the flex hammer. We need a hammer. There we go. We need to get two iron blocks. Nice to have a material in there. An actual hopper. Are we out of iron? Donut Plays is back again. We are low on iron, so let's go and look how much iron we have. Probably not a lot. Okay, this is all stone. Okay, so let's get uh, some more gravel. We're going to have to do the whole gravel thing again, so... Okay. My wand has not very much stuff left on it, but that's okay. We'll, we'll figure this out. Yeah, we'll go old school. Still need to get a hammer. That's okay. To go back up again, but we're slowly getting moved out, moved upstairs. I got this diamond hammer. I could use that, but I, I'd rather use the hammers that I have going right now because I built that for a specific purpose. Okay, so we have our iron hammer, we have a stone hammer too. I should probably get rid of the stone hammer first and use it up. We're getting there. <clears throat> oh, okay. Let's get rid of this. Okay. There we go, getting more materials. Takes a little bit of time. Oh, it's already 11. I usually eat lunch around 11.30 and I'm starting to feel it already. Uh, don't need that up there. Just putting all the pieces parts here up in there. Okay. There's hammer over here. Definitely need a vacuum. Yeah, I am the vacuum. Well, I could make a magnet. That's something I thought about doing. Donna says I barely had breakfast by 11.30. Well, there you go. I usually eat breakfast because uh, I go to work. So I usually have it in the six o'clock hour at some point. Depends on when I get up. Um, but usually lunch is about 11.30. Wow, messy. I'm doing this so I can get iron. I really don't care about the other pieces at the moment, so. There we go. Yeah, I haven't had breakfast yet. I'm not going to do breakfast this morning. I'm just going to have uh, some lunch here in a little bit. Yeah, I must have coffee whenever I wake up. Don't feel like having food after waking up. Um, depends. Like, if I'm going to have food, I don't feel like having coffee. If um, I have coffee, then I don't want to have any food. So. Okay, so iron. Sort that up. Iron, iron, iron. Okay. 37 iron. There we go. So put that there. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, let's get all this up here. Okay. 
Okay, all of this can get out, right? And put into my storage. Yeah, pretty much. Thomas says, I gotta have coffee with my breakfast. I just can't do it. CT says, and here I am waiting for my dinner to cool down enough. Well, yeah, you're uh, you uh, you're uh, like a third shift worker, right? So that makes kind of sense for, for your situation. The nice thing about this colossal chest is you can make it bigger. So I can just make it a five by five when I need to. Eat a little bit. Most of these like, are, are raw ores. There we go. All right. <clears throat> So we're trying to make the flux hammer. Looks like I need to make an actual hopper, which we were trying to do. There's that. And then we need glass. I just need glass. I have four glass, which means I get some sand and cook that down and to make some glass. And we have some sand now, right? There it is. We're gonna get moved up here. Mm-hmm. I can do all of my sand. <clears throat> what if I take all these and just compress them down here? Raw aluminum and zinc and stuff like that. enough glass now surely we have enough glass okay no we don't have enough glass we need to get six glass to make glass panes there you go <clears throat> excuse me tt says yep i work overnight <coughs> excuse me yeah, i knew that tinker and pepsi a forever kind of bond yeah something like that <laughs> Okay, we're trying to make uh, the flux hammer. There we go, got the flux hammer. Now we need to make the flux sieve. These iron bars, we've got that. Another diamond hammer, we've got that. Nope, wrong thing. A sieve. Uh, and another hopper. Two blocks of iron, and we need to make a sieve. Make an oak one, right? Okay, there we go. So this is a basic setup for what we need. I'm gonna just do a, I mean, we got all these platforms here. I mean, that's supposed to be spawning stuff. Let me just, um, I don't where I want to put that. I don't need this here anymore, I don't think. Let me grab this. Let's put this away. I probably should sleep also. Oh, someone just slept. Okay. Um, so we know we have to have like an output, like a barrel. Okay, so let's make a barrel. Put this away here. Okay, so we have our barrel. This is our output. I'm gonna have it facing this way. And I believe the, um, we were gonna hammer down cobblestone and then we're gonna do that into a flux sieve. So let's do this. Okay, that's our sieve. Now, can we make a diamond mesh? I think we got an iron mesh. Let's see if we, let's see if we can go up the mesh tiers here. Cause I know we can make a string mesh. Uh, string mesh. I don't have any more string. Okay. Let's make it some string real quick. Sapling. And we have silkworms. Crook. 
crook? Can I make a crook? I don't know. Do we need a crook to make get silkworms? Uh, we're going to make the diamond sieve, so we need to make... I guess I could take one of these out. Let's make a diamond one. I mean, you know, for whatever reason. We'll get that in a minute. I'll replace it. Uh, mesh. So you can make the diamond mesh already? Yes. And that gets us this quest. That's good. And it gives us a common reward, which gave us oak logs. Great. Well, if you need a crook, you can't use Nixon. Right. Okay. I'm going to put this in here as the mesh. Okay. That has a mesh, which will work for us uh, to be whatever we need. Right. So let's put this back. Put that back. Put that in there. Um, okay. Do I have another hammer already? Because I made an extra hammer. Right. So let's uh, get some of these spare blocks here. Let's get the uh, some cobble. And I'm thinking like, we're gonna put this on top, right? Does this work? So if I put a piece of cobble, what happens? Nothing, because I don't have the power yet, which means we gotta get the power generation. Right? Okay, let's put this right here. Actually, let's put it behind it. My thinking is that it'll be go straight up from the top, right? So let's do this. And power. And a wrench. Every time I watch someone play Minecraft, I want to play as well as Donut. <laughs> Thomas is a good one, CT. <laughs> okay, extract power from this. And we need some coal. Okay, so grab it right here. Okay. Oh, this is good. Can I just... I need shears, right? Let's see. Can I do this? Does it get rid of the, the leaves? Do they just drop the string? No. Okay. We'll get some shears. Actually, I can do it right now. I got flint. Right? Make some flint shears. What? Julius John is here, says, hey there, Tinker. Hey, welcome to the stream. Okay, so let's put power here. Okay, so this is this, uh, see so it's getting power. Now let's see what happens with the cobblestone. Does it get disappeared? Missing inventory output side. Okay, so it doesn't work like that. You have to go to the side. Okay, that makes sense. So let's reconfigure. Uh, let me put, uh, I'm going to use a wood block. I don't want to have the problem of maybe vein mining something wrong. Let's put this right here. Okay, so now it, are, it doesn't have any power in it. Let's put one cobble here and let's let just, I'm just trying to get this to work and see if I can get something going here. from here hey okay, left there I did not see it come in here I would think that it would come into here as gravel oh it did oh wow look at that 
Okay, so we've got a basic setup here. It will grind the things down for us automatically. Um, so this is just a proof of concept. So I think I'm going to bake a platform over here um, that will allow me to make a place for some of this storage and for automation. I think it's going to be my storage area over there, like uh, drawers for things, right? Okay, so I need some cobble. Get some stuff out of here. Okay, we're getting there. All you do is got to keep the generator fed. Yeah, and that is okay. We, we'll get this. We'll get. I'm just like I said, proof of concept, right? So, um, they each stand. I'm gonna say, how many do we need to go per thing? I mean, I almost think I should like fill this in with like some dirt or something. You know what I mean? So, because it, I think it looked really cool having these as dirt corners and grassy. Let's just see about that. Uh, let's do some dirt. Almost enough to do the whole corner. Nice. Install underlayment to protect the dirt. Um, I'm not not this these corner pieces. I'm not going to. I always have going to make it glass at first, but but you know that's that's not that. Did I get any more dirt out of that machine? Just curious. No. I have a couple of saplings. I could probably get one more piece of dirt. That's all I need is one more piece, right? <laughs> so we'll kind of prime it a little bit. Give me the dirt. Convert to dirt. There it is. It just bugs me that one piece there. I like how I can see my pipe. For the lava. That's kind of cool. Okay, uh, let's get, a wall get rid of this first. And let's get some cobble here. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Why am I going into the chest? Oh, terrible, terrible, terrible tinker. Can I make a diamond wand? Yes, I can. Let me just go all the way out. Plenty of uh, space. Now, I have not seen the light overlay work, um, but I think I think it's because there's still like level light levels are still two and above. It's like it's the lava's producing enough light or something. I don't know. Uh, okay, but I mean I can put a torch down at this corner here to help light up a little bit. I hate when I actually build up with a wand. Yeah, I do that too. Okay, so we got that space now. I want to go into here. And I want to get our the chisel. With a stone brick pattern that we liked. And it takes stone brick. So we definitely got to get some stone. So let's go get some stone cooking up in our... 
thing of my jobs, the furnaces. Actually, I'm gonna move the furnaces up top since we're getting kind of close to being up top. And I'm gonna get my compacting drawer here and this drawer here. Okay. Let's get some furnaces going and then Uh, let me put these furnaces down right here for now. And have a stack in each. And then let's fill each one with a stack of cobble. That'll get us the material that I want. Uh... There we go. Had a message from my mother. Okay. Um, so we're going to make a set of storage drawers over here for materials. And I, then I'm going to maybe make the automation on this portion here. So, but what I want to do is I'd like to make this a platform that goes up. So what I'm thinking about is, see how this is kind of like in line with where this border is. There's a border here. I think it'd be, so it's one off from this corner, one off from this corner. We're gonna make like a little platform on my platform. It's a step up. Very cool, right? Okay, I got 23 blocks. So if I use this, I don't want this the stone brick, this one, right? This is this with uh, connected textures on. Yes. Angled steps. We might do angled steps in that. There we go. You can kind of see what I'm doing with this. And then I'll make some sort of steps going up into that. And then on top of that, we're going to have storage drawers. So they're going to be up a little higher. I think that would be kind of cool. Okay. And that in there, get that. Gotta wait on it, I guess. Okay. Um, so we want to have. See, these are going to be producing different things. We're going to be using cobblestone. We're going to use this to make gravel, and then we're going to also do one for sand, one for dust, and start those things going uh, soon. Yeah, I need to get more dirt. Wasn't there a way to get dirt? I mean, you can get dirt from coarse dirt, right? So. Coarse dirt, it takes two dirt to make it, but when you sieve it, does it give you dirt, dirt back? I guess I don't understand. I, I've see, I saw that people were doing this with coarse dirt and you can get gravel and dirt, right? So the chance to get more dirt. So that's something I need to get into also. You know, it's dark out. I'm going to go sleep. Yeah, I think I'm going to need to get into doing that. Uh, sleeping. Yes, my bunk bed. <clears throat> Fool says you get more dirt from not Thomas. I your names are very similar in length and color on my screen. So and you know I can't see very well. Uh 
Okay, uh... That one. Nice little platform. You now this will look kind of cool, I think, when we get it all done. That platform may have to move in. We'll get there. Uh, so let's get a bunch of gravel. We need to get more dirt, don't we? I have none, so... I have some gravel. Do I have any dirt in here at all? Probably not. Trying to think, what can I, how can I easily get dice grower cheese, right? And get some leaves. With that. Some, we got, got the flint down there. Let's do that. I gotta try to get more dirt, guys. Um, so. I gotta get my flint shears. Oh, I have some. These broken, they are broken, so we'll trash that. Oh, I took my things up there. Darn it. But it shouldn't take a lot to do this, right? It's another piece of dirt. So if we got two dirt and you do, what is it, like this to make coarse dirt? Four coarse dirt. I bet two and two is what I put into it. I go over here, I just do this. I just did the gravel by accident. I should have kept the gravel, but I got six dirt. Nice, okay, that works out fantastic. Okay, I have to get, what did I need from here? I needed to get this down. I needed to get, uh, oh, shears. Are we done yet? No, but we're close. Lots of things going on today. Nice, got a little platform. Okay, I'm getting a little bit, I can tell I'm getting hungry and I'm just, I'm starting to lose track of what I'm trying to do. Um, Cause we're gonna be working on get uh, this whole stuff automated. I was thinking that I need to get more dirt for another reason, uh, probably to fill out this stuff is what I was thinking about. Hmm. Okay, I'm out of gravel. So, let me go down here and make some gravel. I didn't get my flint, did I? It's okay. Got some dirt. Uh huh. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, so <clears throat> I want to take that out of my inventory slot and just see if I can get more. There's 16 dirt here. I got 19. Problem is I'm consuming gravel, right? But I guess gravel is more uh, infinite than it's regular dirt. Yeah, I guess so. Wow. That's amazing.
Look at that. Okay. Now I know how to get dirt. Oh, no, no, no. Why is it doing... Oh. I'm saving regular dirt. Ah! Oops. But still, I got a lot of dirt. Okay. Uh, I need to put some of this stuff someplace. Temporarily. Like, in my storage system. Now I know how about that. See, I learned something new, guys. 11.30. I'm going to have to get some food here really soon. Also, I've got chores to do today. Okay, so let's see. I got the chlorite. I could be using that. I'll probably be using that and that. Not this. Uh, you know what? Let's just throw it all in there. I don't care at the moment. Except for the coarse. Or there's got some dirt. Just making sounds. There we go. We got the rest of our stuff. LOL did that many times. Yeah, I think um, you could probably like hold up your inventory with stuff and it won't do it. Okay, so let's just finish this out. All right. Uh, Put this away. Okay, so I got a bunch of dirt. I wanna, I'm gonna put this stack of dirt. We're gonna make stuff out of that in a minute. I'm gonna do 32 dirt here. I'm gonna try to do this side here. So, uh, did I still have a wand? No. I heard pop. Where were snap and crackle? Don't know. See, this is one, two, three, four, right? Yeah. Okay. There we go. I ate them, said Thomas. Wow. Thomas, you're in the zone today. So let me, um, can I make a magnet? A pearl I could. How does it take to get a pearl? I mean, can we get a pearl easily? No. You can't do crushed endstone. I have one crushed endstone. Got another thing on my watch. Uh, I'm starting to get lots of posts from people at that convention that I'm supposed to be at. <clears throat> oh, no, no, no. I type right. Okay. Crushed and stone. There is a chance this will give me a pearl. And it didn't work. Okay, so let's see if we can do that. If I can get a magnet, I want to do that because it'll keep stuff with me. So let's do glowstone. And to get glowstone, it's dust. Right? So let's let's try to make some dust. I'm gonna put this stuff back here. Well, a bunch of gravel, but I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna get all the way down to dust and see if I get a stack of dust and see if we can get a bunch of stuff. Okay, so let's get. There's a compressed cobble. And then let's wand this out. I got some sort of fern. Hammer it. Dust. Try not to sneeze. Okay. I will try not to sneeze. Be nice once I get all this automated. We're not there yet. 
Press sand. Okay. Um, put that one in here too. So we're getting dust. Hopefully we'll get uh, glowstone out of this. A lot of it. So we can get crushed end stone, right? That's what we're trying to get. Man, that sand gets everywhere. Yeah, and if you're Anakin, you don't like it. Thomas says, eat. I will. I uh, left my stuff up top. Thank you. I'll go get that in just a minute. Thank you for the reminder. I like how it's just kind of... And I do get in some close. We do, we do get in... English. Sand is the real true grit. Oh my gosh. But see, a magnet right now would be really good. Oh, okay. <clears throat> We're almost done. I thought that was something there. Okay, we're gonna go up here. We got some bread to eat. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do this. And we need bread. Uh, I hope I put it right in the chest. You like that? Did that, did that again. Put this back. Our bread. Let's eat that so we make Thomas happy. I just don't see the attraction of magnets. Okay, well, there you go. Um, I want to get some pipes. I want to get these things here. We're going to move over the pipe downstairs um, so that it works better. So, uh,. I'm gonna move it out here. And, uh, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna move it like that. <laughs> and then put this right here and then break this connection. Make that extract. Okay. Go. There we go. <clears throat> I find that mag working with magnets can be a rather polarizing experience, says Thomas. Yes, that's true. Ah, Save Our Earth is here, says hi. Just joined the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're just uh, having a little bit of fun, just doing a little bit of automation here. Not a lot, but we're doing some. Uh, I'm trying to get some, I want to get some crushed endstone here. So. If I get some crushed endstone. And let's uh, let's go ahead and sieve this. We're trying to get an Ender Pearl. Let's make sure we're using the right thing too. Ender Pearls come from sieving using. It can use an iron mesh. There's only a 0.5% chance, 1% chance with diamond. So it's rare, but whatever. Let's give this a shot up here. With you know 1%, it could always happen. If I just throw this in here. We got a coarse fruit. Be nice if we got something, right? It's mega slow. And sometimes it doesn't give anything. Okay, we're going to need the rest of our crushed stone here. Oh, 
Ram just joined the game. Welcome, Ram. There's our Ender Pearl. Okay. Let's make this magnet. Charm slot. Excellent. Okay, so. And it's on now, so if we go with the charm slot, can we put it like. Oops. Doesn't magnet itself, does it? Where does this go? There it goes. Okay, so if I throw that out. Nice. I think it's working. Okay, back to doing some dirt stuff. We can put that away and we got gravel. We're going to try to make a lot more dirt. Okay, so there's our coarse dirt, and I think we can, um, like, fill up our inventory, and that will prevent it from picking up the dirt. Um, I saw this is what I think that uh, this is something that um, what's his name did uh, chosen here. I think he use that and then he basically did that okay and then like this so all the spots are filled up so he just kind of and this auto fills his slots right you see how like, it just kind of pops to me now the dirt Is this regular dirt? This is regular dirt. Okay. Now I didn't use any of that dirt up. Excellent. Okay. Got more dirt. Mm hmm. I still want to use up the dirt. You know what I mean? Regular dirt, coarse dirt. Getting some dirt. Okay. So I got a lot more dirt here. That's good. Yeah, I didn't need know that. Now I know about how to get more dirt. That's so much nicer. So if I look here, there's one, two, three, four cobblestone in there. And I, like I said, there's one, two, three, four. Okay, good. Excellent. So then we should just be able to go wand, 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 wand. We need more cobble. It's a dirty job, but someone has to do it. Man, you guys are on par today. Good job. <laughs> okay. Um, wait for somebody to say something else. I'm wait. There's no response coming. I know it. There we go. 
I'm liking the space that I have. And I've got dirt. I can finally finish out this farmland. Even though I may not really need it. Okay. I'm thinking that that platform needs to go away. I mean, I like how far it is, but... You know what I mean? It's kind of in the way. But let's see. Let's fill up this block here. That's a wonderful wand. It is. It's very useful. Okay, so this one here is there's... One here. I'm going to try to make this kind of more like uniform here, so... Uh, this is very difficult for me in my head. So... There's actually five here, right? Yeah. That makes sense. Getting there. Um, <laughs> it's hard, like, figuring this out. <laughs> Angles are terrible. Mm-hmm. Now what? Oh, more notification for people. So there's one, two, three, four blocks out. these jobs wand it those jobs and wand it there we go that's pretty good right so the platform that I built that's far away it was made with the idea that it would be um, that, it, that it would be like a spawning area for passive mobs but because we're in a desert it doesn't spawn anything for passive mobs so it's doing us no good being really far away so I'm thinking like I'm going to make another platform which is right here you can kind of see I've already started this out right this is the edge of that platform. And so this is supposed to be, I need to get rid of that other one too. Ram just left the game. Okay. This needs to go 10 blocks this way. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. This should be four this way. Four, and we're in that. Okay. And uh, same thing there. So, th was it? This again. And we're going to sink this one down. So. Okay. Oh. But it will. You have to be AFK within that range for several hours. I'm in the desert and got three cows and four horses. Uh, it hasn't done anything like that for me at all. Um, and in fact, it even says in the thing that it doesn't spawn. But I'm glad you found it useful because I didn't. Okay. Um, we want here... 
We're going to make the uh, piston trick. I got cows, pigs, horses, and sheep to spawn in the desert. Okay, so it is working. But, I mean, I've been... Well, nothing spawned yet. So, we'll see. But I was going to use delightful dirt and just get to spawn and force it. This stuff here. That's because I want to get below it, right? I hate being low like this, but it's okay. There we go. Okay. Now I'm going to put down some more cobblestone in here. Boom. And now that platform is fine and it looks right. Um, I'm going to make these going raised up like that. So, um, need more cobble. We're getting there, guys. We're getting where I want to be. Although, I'm going to have to get going here in a little bit. I've been on for almost two hours. Uh, yeah. I definitely got to get some food. And I got a lot of chores to do. You know, when Sally Green Gamer was here, we would split up a lot of the things at the house. The house I did half the house duties, basically, right? And now I'm doing all the house duties. So, makes more time. good I think actually I should uh, cook up some more of this stone we're gonna need it right right away so make PPT didn't help exploitation well he does help um, He's very helpful, actually. Um, but he's also very busy with band and some other things, so it's kind of hard for him to do stuff like that, you know? So, I mean, I get it. Yeah. Um, the other thing is is that you recall that over the last uh, last fall, we were having the um, the basement refurbished uh, and finished, so everything was taken out of the basement and was sitting in our garage. And uh, when Sally Green left the house she's still in town but when she left the house uh i wanted to get the cars parked i have a spot so it is working uh the light overlay good apparently right here no i don't need a thingy there let me put that down okay um so all this stuff was in the garage, and I had to get the, all the stuff moved out. So I moved it back in the basement, and now we have both cars parked in the garage, which is excellent. So. Okay. So let's go back into here. And let's make the, get the chisel again. And the blocks. And let's just make another uh, diamond wand. Because we're going to need it, probably. And I did one off of that, right? Right? So from the corner here, one off. So there's basically five little corners. There's five little pieces. 
One, two, three, four, five. Yep. One, two, three, five. Setting up my placeholders for this stuff here. There we go. Now I just want to make these uh, platforms. And then we'll be good. light right there something could spawn but whatever my question is what is the backstory of the whole world being lava in this mod pack um you're in a volcano huge volcano yep so it's kind of a, like a sky block in a volcano that's the best way to describe it okay let's make our chiseled blocks here stone we're doing that one connect the textures on I don't know if you have to do it that way. I mean, I, but I always make sure that they're on. Okay. Let's do that. Fill this in. Second platform is done. Very nice. Okay, and now we can do this next border area. Of this one. Okay. I'm gonna look at the map real quick. So you can see how it's gonna look kind of cool, although it looks like I need to get some more things. Can I... Can I uh, that there all right we're getting there at least the grave mod put stuff back in your inventory instead of just spewing it all over the place like into lava yeah that would be that, that would be bad wouldn't it okay uh chisel i think the texture's on That wand is done. Mm -hmm. I've already involuntarily tested that feature, says Thomas. Nice. Good job. <laughs> All right, guys. So it's uh, noon here. I need to get some food. So I am going to go over to the talk screen and I'm going to log out of the game here. Um, I think what I'm going to do is uh, do some chores today. I might stream again later tonight. Um, or again tomorrow morning and then also the regular stream on Sunday night. So there'll be a couple more streams probably this weekend. Just feels when I get some time, I want to spend my free time playing this. Uh, while we were here, a video did release the next episode of the Mechanical Mastery. Uh, that is getting kind of hard for me. So um, it takes me more time more time to make videos. So that's why the things are coming out a little bit later than usual. I still have to record today's video for that and get that out there. So we'll probably be doing that in a little bit. Um, after lunch, and then of course chores, laundry, cleaning, vacuuming, you know, maybe looking through stuff in the basement, working on train stuff, all sorts of things. So, uh, yeah, I got lots to do. Going to be a busy day, busy weekend. So anyway, guys, thank you for being here. Please come out for the next couple of streams. Let's see if we can get some of my, uh, see, I got this. I, there's one metric I always look at when I stop a stream real quick, and that is called, uh, peak online. It's how many people I have at any one time, and I usually never break the 10. Sometimes I might get 11 or 12, but I never break 10 usually. And even today, it says my peak is only 8 that I can see so far. But I would like to get more and more. I'd like to start to get more people going in and coming in. So if you know anybody, tell them to sh show up. You know, try to get people subscribed. Let's get this uh, channel going again. Uh, I'm trying to kick some fresh blood into it, you know? You know what I'm talking about? Anyway, thanks guys for being here, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.